Indian football team captain Sunil Chhetri has voiced his opinion on sending India's under-20 and under-21 teams to the SAF Championship, emphasizing the importance of providing young players with crucial international experience. Chhetri expressed his belief that participating in the tournament would greatly contribute to the growth and development of budding talents. I have been saying this from, I think, a uh fairly long time that now the SAF tournament for us should be more of sending our 123, 121s and again respecting all SAF countries but that is going to give more exposure to our underage teams because what happens is if the senior team gets let's suppose 10 to 13 good games and if SAF is one of them then the 123s or 121s never get the opportunity so whenever we have sent I think one we sent a team in Bangladesh and again in Bangladesh in my career where we sent an underage team they, and they did really well and they got a lot of games. I think Thapa, Vineet, uh, Subhashis, Manveer, they all went and I think they lost in the finals when they were in Bangladesh but they got so much of exposure. So I completely agree to this point. The more better teams we play, the better for us. Chaitri also addressed the topic of preparation for international tournaments responding to the request made by head coach Igor Stemak for longer preparatory camps. The Indian captain emphasized the need for extended training periods followed by friendly matches against top-ranked teams in Asia. We need it and I really hope that we get it. What happens is when you're playing the ISL, all the boys will be used to the level of ISL, which is the premium level in our country and we're doing really well. But let's be honest to ourselves. When we meet Australia, we would need couple, if not more, level high than what we are facing in ISL. And that is the reason why when we meet together and when we know this and we train this, it helps a little bit. So that's the reason why we need a longer camp. And to take that forward, it will be also great if we can get one of the top seven teams in Asia to play a friendly. Now, this is completely my wish and hope and I'm not saying anything because the coach decides who we're going to play. In regards to his own future with the national team, Chetri revealed that he has not set a specific date for his international retirement. However, he made it clear that he would retire as soon as he feels he is no longer contributing to the team's success. But I don't know. I've never, I, I do not have a date in my head. But I can tell you this, and I'm being very honest from my heart. The day I do not add anything to this team, because I keep, I have very high standards on myself as far as desire, hunger, and giving my best is concerned. The day I'm not adding anything to this team, I'm gone. As simple as that. But I do not have a date in my head. I don't know when it's going to happen. Chetri expressed his anticipation for upcoming tournaments such as the King's Cup in Thailand and the Medrika Cup in Malaysia. These competitions will provide India with the opportunity to face strong opponents like Iraq, enabling the team to further enhance their skills and gain valuable experience against higher ranked teams. Oh, we can't wait. See what happens is when you get this kind of games, Number one, you want to do well. But number two, also you get a reality check. When in SAF, we met Kuwait and Lebanon, you could see those teams are different. And again, without disrespecting any teams from SAF region, but they are different. They come with a different problem. They give you a different things to think about. So that's why it's important. Especially on our route to the Asia Cup, to facing Uzbekistan, Syria and Australia, it is important. The better teams and the more difficult teams we play, the better our preparation is going to be. So Iraq, we are really looking forward to it. It's going to be tough. It's going to be really tough, but we can wait. The recent string of victories in the Three Nations Cup in Manipur, the Hero Intercontinental Cup and the SAF Championship has boosted the team's confidence and garnered significant interest in Indian football. Chetri highlighted how these success have not only motivated the players but also placed pressure on all stakeholders to ensure a strong performance in the upcoming AFC Asian Cup.